The barrel cam is part of your recip saw's blade lock assembly. The cam is a plastic drum that fits over the blade clamp. It has a lever that is pressed to release the clamp. When the lever is pressed, the drum engages with the clamp and the blade is released. Over time, the barrel cam can wear until it no longer operates the blade clamp. It can be broken if the saw is dropped. Replacing the barrel cam is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Socha. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the shoe from the recip saw. Next, I'll remove the rubber boot. I'll need to pry the rubber boot away from the lever on the barrel cam. I'll slide the boot away from the saw. Next, I'll remove the gear case cover. Next, I'll remove the brackets so I can slightly pull the shaft from the housing to remove the barrel cam. That'll give enough play to pull the shaft up so I can remove the barrel cam. I'll also need to remove the extension spring. Now we can install the new barrel cam. First, I'll transfer the extension spring from the old barrel cam to the new. Now I can install the barrel cam and spring back onto the saw. I'll lift the shaft enough so I can slide the barrel cam between the shaft and housing. I'll bring the spring behind the barrel cam and secure it to the housing. The extension spring fits into a groove in the housing. Next, I'll re-secure the bracket with the screws. Now, I'll reinstall the gear housing cover. I'll reinstall the rubber boot and the shoe. And that's how you can install a new barrel cam in your recip saw. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.